Hello guys, I am Vijay Anand from Electronic Thumblan and today we are going to build a circuit called Regulated Power Supply and uh, let's go. Uh, yes, uh, this left side of the circuit contains a step down transformer which converts uh, 230 volt uh, AC into 12 volt DC. I am using just a 12012 12 transformer which is nothing but uh, by using these two N12 and 12 terminals will give us uh, 24 volt but uh, when we are using this 12 and 0 terminal we will be getting uh, uh, 12 volt output. Uh, which is step down from 230 volt mains and uh, these four diodes actually is used for uh, rectification purpose which will be converting to AC to DC which is nothing but uh, normal 1N4007 diode and uh, this capacitor is used for uh, filtering purposes which will be uh, removing voltage spikes removing voltage spikes from the AC which is uh, which is being converted into DC and uh, this LM317 317 is a voltage regulator which gives us variable power supply uh, with uh, it has pin diagram like this the uh, three third pin is uh, named as input and uh, second pin is output and uh, first pin is adjust pin which is usually, usually connected to a potentiometer which is uh, normally a 10k pot uh, which is used for adjusting the voltages and this 1k is connected in parallel to 211 and the uh, uh, remaining end 10 mu of 50 volt capacitor is used for uh, uh, filtering purposes as, to, as we seen in uh, previous case ok guys now we will see the waveforms of the rectifier circuit now this is the input waveform that is the figure shown at the top is the input waveform and uh, when we uh, you can see that both the cycles are uh, taking place in the input waveform one is the positive off cycle and other one is the negative off cycle during the positive off cycle the diodes D1 and D4 will be forward biased and the other two diodes D2 and D3 will be reverse biased so the diodes D1 and D4 only conducts so uh, during the positive cycle you, you will get the output and uh, in the reverse bias condition the diodes D2 and D3 will be forward biased the D1 and D4 uh, will be reverse biased so during the negative cycles also you will get the output so the overall output you can see here uh, but you can see some spikes in that output so that when we add a capacitor to it we will get a direct straight line a straight DC current Hope guys, you all understand about the process of rectification from AC to DC using LM317. You can also use uh, 7805, 7809 and 7812 for constant voltage regulation. And sorry to say this, I am Sayuraman from Electronic Terminal. Thank you, bye.